Good morning, everyone. Granny here. Uh, praise God. One day closer to going home. I wanted to do a quick video today. Um, uh, I want to do a prayer call for Israel. They're under attack. Uh, that Israel is is our time clock, people. It's it's what we we look towards to find out how far we are. And uh, but look up. Your redemption draws near. Praise God, your redemption draws near. But I wanted to put this out here. Uh, we need to pray for Israel. Uh, I think it's like a hundred so far that's lost their lives over there. Uh, they were attacked from the Gaza Strip. Uh, Y'all look into it, and and let's keep an eye out open and let's let's pray for Israel. Uh, Israel is God's treasured possession. And God chose Israel on whom to set his affection. Uh, God's love for Israel is everlasting. And it says in Jeremiah 31, 3, I have loved you within an everlasting love. And uh, God loves for is God's love for Israel shows through his favor towards those who love her. And uh, in Genesis 12, 3, uh, I will bless those who bless you, and whosoever curses you, I will curse, and all people on earth will be blessed through you. Um, so, um, and in, in Psalms 122.6, it says, Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. May those who love you be secure. Be secure. Uh, Zechariah 2.8 says, For this is what the Lord Almighty says, say, for who, whoever touches you touches the apple of his eye. Israel is the apple of his eye. And we need to pray for Israel. This is, this is where our Lord and Savior gave his life for us. This is the place. This is where he gave his life for us. Pray for Jerusalem. And this is where he's coming back. And, uh, it, it it's everything we need to look for for his coming and, and coming to get us these are the things the next the next big event for the whole world is going to be that rapture and it's fixing to happen everything's falling into place man just just a few weeks ago they were talking peace over there and then just this morning all of a sudden israel's under attack oh my goodness people we don't have long we don't have long. Praise God. Let's just, let's pray for Israel and pray. I pray for Israel every night anyway. I do. I, I prayed for Israel. I've been praying for Israel for years, but this is important. We, I'm just uh, doing a special call for Israel, prayer for Israel. Um, that's going to be added to the list. We don't know what's fixing to happen over there. So let's just, everybody keep your eye open because this, this is, this is things that we're watching for. This is what we're watching for. Oh, man, I just can't believe that everything that the Lord spoke of is happening right before our eyes, people. Prophecies being fulfilled right before our eyes. And that's why I said the other day, man, this generation was chosen for that. Can you believe it? I believe it. I do. I believe it. So, I mean, I'm, it, it says in the Bible to rejoice when you see all these things. For your redemption draws near. So, you know, I'm praying for them. And, I, and I, I'm praying for the families of over there that lost a loved one. And 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 I'm praying for Israel. And, and we need to pray for them. But rejoice because your redemption draws near. Uh, so I wanted to do a quick video to, to put out a call for prayer for Israel. Um, I'm sorry I'm making this video so short. It's Saturday and I'm trying to enjoy the day with my husband. So, uh, and I saw this and I said, we, we need to get this. Uh, somebody commented on my last video, said we need to pray for Israel. And it was this morning when I got it. And the minute I read that comment is when it was uh, talking about it on the news. And I was like, wow. I mean, that just, that hit me like a ton of bricks. <laughs> you know, we need to pray for Israel. We need to pray for Jerusalem. And I've, I've been praying for peace, love, joy, and safety for Israel for years. I've been praying that prayer. So um, 
you know, uh, God loves Israel and Israel is the apple of his eye. It's, it's um, so um, uh, we need to do a special prayer for them. And y'all keep an eye out on what's going on over there. And I do have a prayer list and I've gotten more names. So rather than going, I forgot where I was at. Okay. Rather than going through the whole list, I want to let everybody know on the previous list that we're still praying for you. Uh, I have a bunch more. I mean, one after another that needs prayer. And um, um, Isabella, devoted to God, uh, is uh, praying for test results. Um, Bride of Christian, 726. Home and car, uh they, they need prayer for their finances because they're they're uh, losing their home. Uh, their landlord is selling the property and they're going to have to move. And their car broke down. And they need prayer for that. And uh, Roxy, 174, daughter and son, uh, finances. Uh, Soy, seven, demon attacks. Uh, Elizabeth, uh, Elizabeth. H-A-A-S, 1899, grieving badly over uh, losing her daughter, We're praying for you. Uh, Cindy, Bar Cindy Barnes, 1533, rejection. Uh, her family rejected her in depression and uh, anxiety. Uh, Denise is Press, 3288, uh, praying for her daughter, Michelle conversation uh sanct sanctification and salvation uh, praise god people praying for their children we need to pray for them and mandy c uh 1716 children's salvation son especially who's being attacked by demons and daughter's disability uh hurts for eddie uh has a uh, uh, father uh, suffering from alcohol addictions and he wants prayer for, for forgive and heal so let's pray for these people but I want to make number one on that on that list Israel Israel is number one on that list so I pray for all all I'm praying for all these prayers and the ones that I've announced before is so long and when I go live I will announce all of them but right now I don't have much time so God bless all of you. Praise God. And, and just keep watching and praying. Put on the whole full armor of God. And uh, put on your wedding clothes. Get your oils lamps ready. And and uh, be ready. Because we're going to hear that trumpet sound just any time now. Things are happening. And it's only going to progress from this point on. So just keep watching and praying. And, and, and keep in touch with what's going on over in Israel. Because that's our time clock. And let's pray for these people. Let's pray for these people. So I love all of you. God bless you. I just wanted to put out this call. And uh, God loved you first. And God bless you all. Thank you all for watching.